Dolphins visiting the Chargers. Dolphins plus three. Ton of money coming in on the Dolphins. Most of the tickets coming in on the Dolphins. They're a little bit of a a public darling right now because of what they did in that offense. Obviously, there's a lot to be seen for how Tua can uh, protect himself. Um, Man, it's weird to me that so much money, Simon, is coming in on the Dolphins. I don't think this is a contest play for us, but something's, you know, pardon the pun, fishy about that much money coming in on the Dolphins against a Chargers team that we kind of like. Yeah, if it gets a three and a half, maybe that'll give me some pause and maybe I will take Miami, but you could have got Chargers two and a half. Still at a couple of books, you can still get it. That's that's the play. You're taking the the better team at home under a field goal. We already saw, if you go back and watch a tape from last year, the Chargers defense-wise, they matched up really well against what this Miami team likes to do on offense. They totally shut them down um, last season. So, you know, He's been hearing about it all week. We'll see if Mike makes the adjustments here for the Dolphins. But, you know, McDaniels has – he de- he definitely has a, a lot of weapons at his disposal here. But so do the Chargers. So it, it's one of those where this will be the biggest bet overs of the week. Everyone's going to be on this over. Um, yeah, if you can get Chargers two and a half, I'd take it. If you can get Miami later in the week at three and a half, I'd take that too. It just feels like this is a three-point game. Um, so, yeah, Chad, you're right. It's – it's not a play for us, but if you're looking for what side I'll be on, I'll be on the Chargers at two and a half, three. 